In this video, we'll demonstrate how to configure the RadGrid component to export data to Microsoft Word and Microsoft Excel. We'll start by bringing in some data so we have something to export. So the first thing we'll do is connect to the Northwind database. We'll select all of the columns out of the alphabetical list of products test to make sure we connected correctly and finish. Then let's bring a rad grid component onto the form and the rad grid needs to connect up to the data source. And that's all we need to do with the grid. And finally, let's put a couple of buttons onto the form. And the first button we'll say that that's going to export to Microsoft Word. And I guess the second button is going to export to Microsoft Word. And this first button is going to export to Excel. So I'll double click on the Excel button then we'll just paste in some code that I've prepared already. What this code does is it says we're only going to export the data. So for instance, if there were controls inside your RAD grid, this setting says only export the data. Ignore paging means we're going to export everything that's there. We're not going to worry about whether there's like 20 items per page and stopping after that. It's going to open the output in a new window. And in this case, it's going to export to Excel. Now we'll do the same thing with the word button and again inserting code except this time we're going to export to Word. So let's run the project and take a look at the results. And you see there's our output data and if we go down to the bottom if we click on Excel tell it we want to go ahead and open this and so we get an Excel spreadsheet with all of our data exported out. Pretty convenient. So if we close that up without saving any changes, we'll do the same thing, exporting it to Word. And the Word document again comes out in a columnar format with all of our data extremely simple to use RadGrid component to export to Word or Excel. For more Telerik videos, technical support forums, and examples, please go to www.telerik.com.